Well, in the weeks and months to come, relief agencies in Haiti are going to actually be relying on equipment that's being produced by a very small company based in Minden. It's a familiar role for Aqua Sun International, and it's going to be a crucial one in the weeks and months ahead. Colawake News Now's Ed Pierce is here with the story, and Ed, this company produces water purifiers. Very simple purifiers. Uh, that can work anywhere. They've been filling a steady need for these units in the third world for years, but when disaster strikes, that need becomes critical and the demand overwhelming. Clean water, it may be the most basic of human needs. In the best of times, it's in limited supply in Haiti. Now in the wake of the earthquake, it will be critical if disease is to be kept from dealing the next big blow to a shattered nation. A partial solution will begin flowing, strangely enough, from this anonymous building thousands of miles away in Minden. This is the home of Aquasun International. Their product, solar-powered water purifiers. They range from small units that could fit in a suitcase to larger models on self-contained carts, and they are all suddenly in great demand. When the earthquake happened that afternoon, I was contacted, be ready because we're going to start ordering. And then over the weekend, uh, we got to go ahead to uh, start building our systems for World Vision. And the first round of ordering between World Vision and the Gates Foundation has come in, and so that's what we're gearing up for right now. The purifiers that emerge from this shop are simple, rugged, easy to maintain. Ideal, Hansen says, for the difficult environments beyond modern infrastructure. Powered by the sun, they pump water through a series of filters and ultraviolet rays, turning the worst water pure and healthy by the hundreds of gallons. They have, over the years, been bought by and used by missionaries and relief agencies literally all over the world a number of them in Haiti. Uh, we do a lot of work in Haiti and really probably if any place in the world has the most systems in one local spot it would be Haiti. We Suddenly there's a need for a lot more and Hansen's firm is gearing up to meet the demand. Um, just, I'm just overwhelmed with emails right now from people all over the, all over the country and all over the world who want to help. This is a business, but Hansen says the relief effort also makes his company and staff part of something bigger. I have a lot of the people that I have done worked with with the Christian firms and stuff sending me emails back going, Greg, these are the stories that are coming out. And to uh, hear about everything that's going on, it's pretty heartbreaking. Now, it's likely these shipments will contain more than just the equipment. This company shipped a number of their units to Indonesia following the tsunami there. And in place of packing material in the shipping containers, they substituted small stuffed toys for the children there. It's likely the shipments to Haiti will contain the same personal bonus. Sarah? Good story there, Ed. Thanks. Aqua Sun expects to ship a number of the units to Nellis Air Force Base in southern Nevada in the next few days. With orders piling up, that shipment promises to be the first of many.